Okay, today we're going to talk about seal replacement of a 3000 series swivel joint. The tools you're going to need, a degreaser, a magnetic pen, a socket wrench, and the seal replacement kit. With a 3000 series swivel, it's necessary to remove the ball bearings to gain access to the seals. The first step you'll want to do is remove your ball plug. To do so, you'll do it with your socket wrench, which will give you access to your ball bearings. At this point you'd use your degreaser, continue to rotate to break down the grease inside the joint, and then you can start to pull the ball bearings out. This is where the magnetic pen is going to help remove the ball bearings. So with the grease broken down, you can begin to remove all the ball bearings. You'll just have to keep working the swivel back and forth until all the ball bearings are out. When all the ball bearings have been removed, you can then slide the tail out of the body, which will give you access to the seals. In this case, we have a Elastomeric O-ring main seal and a felt environmental seal. In your seal replacement kit, you'd have a new O-ring, which you'd insert down into the body, a felt dust seal, which you'd wrap around the tail. Now, in some cases, you may have an O-ring in place of the felt dust seal, which you would put in the same groove. With your main seal and environmental seal in place, you then insert the tail back into the body until everything is seated. At this point, begin to replace the ball bearings into the swivel. And you want to drop them in and just rotate to get them to distribute within both races. Completely fill both races. You should not have any gaps at all. And at that point, you'll know that the races are full. So with your ball plug back in place, you'll take your socket to retighten. At that point, you'll want to grease, rotate, grease with a manual grease gun. A couple of notes, the seal replacement for a small swivel like you see here all the way up to a 12 inch, the procedure is identical. The other note is you'll see in your seal replacement kit you have a main seal, a elastomeric environmental seal, and your felt environmental seal. If the swivel you're repairing has a felt seal, you'll use the felt environmental seal. If it has a elastomeric or rubber environmental seal, you would use the elastomeric seal. And that's it.